New information tonight in the shooting of a 19 year old girl last night at the Comfort Suites Hotel in Canton. The teen worked at the hotel as a clerk. Moments after the shooting, police say the gunman ran away and was hit by two cars. Priya Mann has the latest on this investigation. The Canton police chief says this hotel was busy Friday night when a gunman burst through the front doors and his target was a young girl working at the front desk. He was determined to uh, kill her. A 19 year old Detroit girl was shot and killed in the front lobby of the Comfort Suites Hotel in Canton. He fires behind the counter or tries to then later get somehow gets behind the counter and that's where he uh, we know at least one shot killed her. Police say the victim and the gunman had been in a long term relationship, but had broken up shortly before the deadly shooting. It seems like it was planned out very well. The teen was killed around 930 Friday night. She worked at Comfort Suites as a receptionist. You know, this was a young woman. She's at work. She's going about her life. That's true. Yeah, she's getting started out in life. She's working. Uh, you know, it looks like the afternoon shift at a, at a hotel performing a service that we all need when we travel and uh, she lost her life. The gunman is a 23 year old man who lives in Wayne. After killing his ex girlfriend, he ran away from the hotel. It looks like he was hit by at least two vehicles on I-275. Our uh, fire department was able to um, get him to a hospital. The chief says notifying the young victim's family was heartbreaking. You don't even have the words when you break these um, break the news to families and provide these notifications that they just lost their loved one. A tragic and senseless case of domestic violence that ended with a young girl brutally shot and killed. Such a repetitive event in our country. I don't know what to say besides um, take a moment, take a breath. Take the opportunity to not only save the person you're thinking about hurting's life, but your own. And police say the gun used in this deadly shooting was stolen. That gunman remains in critical condition. If he survives, he is facing a long list of charges. In Canton, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4. Thank you, Priya.